Bohemians scored two late goals to secure a 3-2 victory over Dundalk, which will have a prominent say in how the European spots are handed out at the end of the season in a game that really could have gone any and either way. The goals started early with James McManus, who just finished his leaving cert earlier on this week, latching on to a Jonathan Afalabi cross to slot it past Nathan Shepard. But Dundalk responded extremely well with the first goal coming from Yanis Yelikoko, his second goal at the Dalyman Park ground this season, as he caught the, the Bohemians' defence napping and slotted the ball past Talbot. Dundalk got a free kick and took it quickly, which was a cross-field ball to Archie Davies, the architect of the second goal for Dundalk, as he whipped in a fantastic ball for Conor Malley, who set up Yeli Coco for the first goal to score the second. Dundalk were in complete control of this contest, but Bohemians really turned the screw as the game continued on. And Chris Trotic and John O'Sullivan were called into the fray, and they made an immediate impact. Chris Trotic's cross into the Dundalk area caused the, the Dundalk defence to be at sixes and sevens, but O'Sullivan was at the back post and he slammed it past Shepard in order to equalise. Dundalk FC looked as if they were going to hold on for a point only for Jonathan Avalabi to break free of the Dundalk defence as they were caught flat-footed and he slotted a pass underneath Shepard to send Dalyman Park into raptures. The action wasn't finished yet with a flurry of yellow cards and it looked as if John Martin had bundled the ball over the uh, Bohemians line in the 90th minute only for a last ditch stop from James Talbot but another fantastic defence display has to go for Hayden Muller of Dundalk who could have seen his side concede another goal only for him hooking the ball off the line at the very last second earlier on in the contest for Dundalk FC that's their last Premier League division action before they go into Europe but a big big say when it comes to the European places come season end for Final Whistle.ie I'm Kieran Callan.